This is a quick video to Rebecca Watson and Ophelia Benson and Stephanie Zvon regarding their particular issue with uh, Richard Dawkins and uh, comparing uh, teaching a child about hell in comparison to either child abuse or rape. Okay, I'm here to tell you, as a woman who grew up with child abuse, maybe not in the sexual sense, but in the physical sense for a very long time and as a woman who has dealt with rape and as a person who grew up with and was indoctrinated into the whole teachings of Christ and God and Christianity I'm here to tell you and I don't care if you fucking call this an anecdote or whatever personal experiences count I still to this day have nightmares about being burnt eternally forever for not being a godly person okay I have those sorts of nightmares way more often than I ever have as a child who was beaten physically and as an adult who was raped horribly okay so I don't have a problem with Richard Dawkins and what he says because what you women don't realize or understand because perhaps you haven't gone through all three things uh, but uh, the over and over and over again indoctrination of how horrible it will be in hell and what sort of things people will go through in hell as far as eternally burning over and over again has a huge huge mental impact on the mind of somebody who's young um, as somebody who used to be younger being beat on the head by somebody has some long-term effects definitely uh, but I got to the point where I understood this was a physical thing this was something that eventually I s was able to stop and something I was able to deal with my rape it is not an ongoing and it is not a purely mental and mental visual thing that happened to me it was very real so something I c could tangibly deal with both things were something I could tangibly deal with because they were actual physical acts okay being told as a child about burning hell and burning in it forever for an eternity with no end that is something that's fucked up and it's hard to deal with that's something you can't pull out of your mind even I'm not saying every atheist but for a lot of atheists I'm thinking this is something that they can't really pull out of their psyche because it is such a uh, mentally visual thing is the best way I can put it put it into so you know what fuck you Ophelia Benson fuck you Rebecca Watson fuck you Stephanie Zvon for attempting any stupid ass way to speak for the rest of us okay Richard Dawkins probably hit the nail on the head pretty squarely with this one it's not something you can uh, deal with visually because it's not something that actually has happened to you it's something that inherently attacks the psyche of you of a human being okay no human being wants to burn okay so this is something that attacks a very basic psychological level of another human being so fuck all three of you for attempting to say that is not the same thing until you can go through those sort of things until you can say I have been physically raped I have been physically abused I have had this yeah, yeah, fine you can give me those stories that's fine but don't sit there and and pull out of your ass that Richard Dawkins doesn't know what he's talking about okay so a big hearty fuck you to all three of you